This is the green, the heart of UD's campus. It's a great place to take a selfie, meet up with friends for a club meeting, or just to throw a frisbee. On the North Green, there are academic buildings that house departments in pretty much every college. On the South Green, past Memorial Hall, there's Morris Library, academic buildings, and a few residence halls, including Sussex, Kent, and Newcastle, named after the three counties in Delaware. Yeah, just three counties, Delaware is a small state. At the center of the green are the kissing arches, where, legend has it, if you kiss someone under them, that's the person you'll marry. Marking the end of the green and cutting right through campus is Newark's Main Street, which has over 75 restaurants and cafes, the UD bookstore, a movie theater, drugstore, gift shops, and a grocery store. Gore Hall, also on the green, gives us a chance to peek inside an academic building. Walking past the atrium, we arrive at classrooms designed to accommodate many different classes in many different fields. So by the end of your four years at UD, you're bound to take a class here. Everyone knows this building. Just off the center of the green is Morris Library, named after UD alum Judge Hugh Morris. It has four levels of books, movies, and study spaces, some quiet and some collaborative. On the lower level is our Multimedia Design Center, where students can borrow video cameras and microphones, use multimedia software and reserve production studios, including a virtual reality studio. There's also a cafe and a small self-checkout market. During midterms and finals, the library is open 24-7 and offers stress-relieving activities, therapy dogs, and a hot chocolate bar. Leaving the library, you'll notice a bronze sculpture of Hugh Morris. Legend has it, rubbing his nose will give you good luck on exams. I'm not saying our students are superstitious, but his nose has been rubbed to a high shine.